Yeah, you know the vibes is DP215. I'm back with another one to let you know where I'm coming from. All I do is expose the truth and let it go to the youth. Coming straight from the gut and you already know what's up. Shout out to Yo Gotti. I seen a little clip of a young bum ass weirdo attempting to rob him for the jewelry that he earned. Jealousy, boredom, guns, they don't mix, man. Then somebody put a battery in his back, said, go ahead, got a lick, go ahead, hit that lick, hit that lick. He got about almost a million dollars in jewelry on him, hit that lick real quick, nope, nope. Don't he feel stupid? Don't he feel stupid? I respect that. Even though it's very dangerous to hit a nigga with a gun. I respect that. I don't respect no nigga that rob niggas. No nigga. You's a bitch. Big facts, nigga. If you feel like that's your destiny or that you don't got no other way to make money, nigga, you's a bitch. You've given up on life. You scum. You a bum. You ain't worth shit. You stink. Your mom should have spit you the fuck out. Nobody like you. You weird. You corny. You don't got your own shit. Probably stay in the fucking corner of a basement somewhere. I don't like those type of people, man. Because they see you looking some type of way out here and try to slide on you. Try to catch you slipping. Well, yeah. Guess what? Bag snatcher. You little fucking bitch. Mission failed. Gonna need backup. Mission failed. Mission failed, bum. On to the next one. Thought it was a sweet lick. Socked your ass and kept moving. I respect that. I really do. With I give your Gotti the utmost respect. Because I don't think I could punch a nigga with a gun. I can't do it. I just think it's going to go off. You know what I mean? I just think it's going to go off. And, and niggas ain't got no aim. It just might hit you. So I, I respect them. And I feel as though. As long as motherfuckers doing shit like that. People going to think twice. About trying to get an easy lick on a nigga. You feel me? Because that could have been anybody. Like, the, anybody could have had them changed right there in that spot. And he probably would have hopped out. Anybody. That could have been anybody. I'm glad he didn't... Yo Gotti didn't get hit. You know what I'm saying? Now, I'm not saying Yo Gotti's a good Samaritan. But I feel like anybody trying to rob niggas in a time like this, especially... Take the gun that you have, right... I don't know, you probably stole it because you're robbing niggas. Put it to your head and bung that shit, man. Just bung that shit. Get rid of yourself. Why you feel like you got to rob niggas, man? I don't understand these characters out here, man. They're not human. They're not humans. He woke up with robbery on his mind. He, before he left out of that bed, he said, I'm going I'm to rob me a nigga today. I'm going to catch me a lick. And I'm, I'm, I'm gonna get, I'm gonna be successful with this lick. Ain't wrong, ain't wrong. Far from successful, nigga. Punched you all in your fucking face, nigga. You ain't know what to do. It's about time. More people start fighting back, because as long as motherfuckers think they can get away with shit, they're gonna keep trying it. Somebody got to be the hero out here. Somebody's got to be the hero. You feel me? Now, I'm not saying everybody bring a fist to a gunfight. Nope. You just might not win. The motherfuckers will kill your ass. Bullets kill. Fists hurt people. Bullets kill. Be smart. But it does make people think twice. 
It does. Successful. Or you just might just be a fly nigga. Motherfucker might think you got money. Think about it like that. You you ain't got to be on your Gotti status. You could just be a fly looking nigga. And the motherfucker checking you out like, yo, I know he got a bag on him. Approach you with that pistol. What you going to do? You going to give him the money or the jewelry you got? Or you going to try to fight your way out of there? The choice is on you. I respect you either way. Long as you get out of there without a scratch or a bullet in you, I respect you either way. What I don't respect is the nigga pulling up on you with a gun because he ain't got no other way to get money. Fuck that nigga. You hear me? Fuck that nigga. He is a whole bitch. His daddy need to be fucking slapped for spitting out that bullshit. And got it running around thinking that's the way to live. His daddy need to be slapped. He need to be slapped. And his mom need to be slapped for the crack she was smoking when he was in her stomach. You feel me? Everybody need to be the fuck slapped. Real hard. And they like playing with guns, right? So they need to be slapped with a gun. That's what I think. You hear me? It's one of those, you pussy. I'm in my bag today. It's like that. It's up and it's fucking stuck. Fuck all these hating ass niggas out here, man. You hear me? Death to all haters, man. They have no other and they have no other ambition but to take. That's their ambition. Take, 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 take. They ain't making shit. I know a lot of haters. I live around haters. So when I hear about shit like that, it only just put me on guard and, and get me ready for some shit. Because I like to look fly. And I'm not going to stop looking fly for no bitch ass nigga that don't look fly or, or don't know how to get fly. Or don't got no money to get fly. That ain't nothing to do with me, nigga. Get a fucking job. Hustle. You feel me? Start your own business. Get on YouTube. I don't know what to tell you. That's your way? You resort to that? Robbing niggas? Because you can't earn a dollar? Scum, man. Real scum. I ain't going to talk all day. No, I go down. I get in my bag sometimes. You know what I mean? Know the fucking vibes? Know to find me in a 2-1 foot eye.